Hello, it is Tuesday, November 22nd, 2011 at 11.45 p.m. Central Standard Time. And I was on AccuWeather checking out this little oh, scalar square thing showing up here in Iowa. They're showing up oh, about 12 a.m. Eastern Standard Time. It's about a half an hour ago. And I went over to IntelliCast to see if anything was showing there, and I ran into the most unusual thing. There's spots everywhere. <laughs> this was earlier in the day. Um, this is the, let me show you where, where, what we're looking at. Under layers on IntelliCast, you can find this temperature for North America. And the loop goes back quite a ways. And so the other day I actually saw some scalar squares show up on the temperature and I was checking out checking to see if that was the case again and but then I, I ran into all these spots this is this is most unusual um, I don't think I've ever seen it before you know maybe a spot here or there but not I mean this goes all the way let me make this more transparent I mean we're up into Nebraska here actually South Dakota this one's in South Dakota um, Kentucky Georgia one in Florida here um, Texas of course has quite a few and then these may be even similar over here in Arizona I can't quite tell if it's the same thing but let me go ahead and play this through and you can see the difference I'm gonna make it um, opaque again just so that you can see them better and then hopefully this will start looping. This is what it should look like, or normally looks like. And I've had it before where there were, were spots associated with some interesting cloud formations. And I went and checked that out. I'll show you that in a minute here. So this, see, this is, this is just not normal. Um, let me go back, click back so we can so this is 1300 Eastern Standard Time. There's 14, 15, and then at 1600 it, it goes back to normal. And let's see if I can... 1400 would be 2 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. Well, actually, they start at 1300, so that would be at 1 p.m. So that's 1 p.m., 2 p.m., 3 p.m. And I went to College of DuPage just to check out the clouds. And this is the water vapor. And it's ending at 5 on November 22nd, 5.15 UTC, starting at about 6. So we'll go up here I need to I can't quite get to what I'm trying to do here let me stop this and click an arrow sometimes when you click this then your arrow keys work yeah there we go praise the Lord okay let's see going back down here what's interesting is this, this storm and this system's actually going across the the southeast and up into the northeast as we speak um, but it's coming out of um, Laughlin Air Force Base here it looks like let's go back to the beginning so there's also a, there's already was a system in place but there, there's something intense that's coming out of this Air Force Base or the area of it now I don't know if that's causing the, the little dots we started at 5.45 UTC on the 22nd, which would be midnight last night. So that's a good 12 hours before those little dots appeared, although they could have been there earlier because the loop they were there at the start of the loop. So I'm going to and here's up in Nebraska, so they were all up into here and all into here. 
And that's kind of the area of this interesting cloud. I'm going to go ahead and loop through. We'll stop at 13. Well, that's 13 Eastern Standard Time. So that would be 18 UTC time. And once that comes up, that's now this won't start. Okay, let me go back up. Click on this. Oh no, it won't. So I'll just use my arrows. We'll we're at 1715, 45, 1815. So this is about this is the point where the we're seeing the spots on the temperature. And I'm not seeing anything obvious, although this is kind of all well that is kind of interesting actually. Let's go zoom in on that. These clouds all look like they've been um blown apart or something. <laughs> We went, just went backwards, now we're moving into it. Oh, yeah, they look pretty ripped up, don't they? That's it. Um, I'm going to have to move this. Once you zoom in, you got to <laughs> move it around to go find the time. 1945. So that's at 1445. So that's right when those dots appeared on the temperature. Well, that's very interesting. Um, going forward, a few more. Okay, this is a really strong line here too. I'm going to unzoom it. Didn't notice that a little while ago when I was checking it out. So, and I'm going to go ahead and let the loop play through. We'll slow it down, get it going forward, start. And be starting over at the loop. Yeah, here was. Although you're not seeing, I wasn't, didn't see that same thing happening over here. So anyway, there you have it. I, I that is <laughs> quite interesting. God bless you and have a good rest of the night. Sleep well.